All right, guys. So I left. I came back to get this ladder. Um, and just in case I don't post the prior video because it was like 10 minutes long already. I tested the fuses. I tested a fire thing, and then I was monkey barring this thing, getting on top of it, and it was just stupidly dangerous. Um, don't do that. And uh, so I decided to go get my, uh, you know, step stool. All right, so the power's off. Um, let's make sure power is off. Okay. All right, so we're not getting any 24 volts uh, to the unit. So I'm going to have to turn it on. And I also check these resettable fuses, but we might have a rollout. Maybe I should just go ahead and check that. It's in this yeah, belt could have snapped. Sometimes a belt will snap and it'll hit that rollout and the wires from it will actually get knocked off the uh, unit. Well, it looks like we got one screw just halfway in there holding this. Yeah. More than just halfway in there. All right, hold on, guys. Where am I pointing at? There we go. I like this uh, little GoPro. Got a little LCD in the back. I can actually tell where where I'm actually pointing and stuff. All right, so that's the only screw that was in there. Oh, heavy ass pedals. There we go. <sighs> Da, da, da. I hope it's not. There's no rollout in here. Where's the damn roll? Usually there's a rollout on that. I bet somebody bypassed it right here. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah. I bet that used to be the rollout or something. So I don't see any rollout. You know feel any resistance on that that belt has a little bit of wobble in it yeah okay all right well looking for signs of oil but i don't see any yet just we don't have 24 volts and I thought maybe a rollout was uh, part of our problem but I'm pretty sure that was the uh, yeah I'm pretty sure that was a rollout that was connected to here somewhere probably went over I don't know I have no idea I'll put that up there the motor's been replaced before. You can tell just by that stuff. Let me turn off my radio so that's not disturbing y'all. All right, I'm not gonna check those caps because we don't have any 24 volts, so. And the wires going to low pressure is, uh, high pressure is blue, low pressure, well, that's the freeze up. Well, I'm gonna have to take this one step by step, guys. Doggone it. This is what it is, bro. Alright, let's uh, turn our own. See if we get any 24 volts. Which I already know we don't. Alright, I wish there was a place to put y'all. But there's not that good a place but I want to work better than nothing I just done by myself Let's see. nothing of course because if we were getting all right let's try um transformer 
That's just gonna be your secondary. Transformer number one, which I don't think has, well, could. Uh, nothing, guys. What the fuck? All right, let's go all the way back to main power. Ninety-six volts. All right, now we got a problem here. Seventeen volts to phase A, B, and C. Up. Oh. What? All right, everything but this phase. Seventeen point four volts. Don't tell me this is another phase loss bull crap. It is. Well, doggone it. Bruh. See what's coming out of this transformer because it looks like it knocks it down anyway. It breaks the blue. Um, comes that leg anyway. It's knocked off anyway. Get a good ground point. Here's a ground wire right here. 118. 119. That's the only two coming in here. Oh, okay, hold on. But we need three phase for this stuff here. There's this Chimney crickets. 118. 118. 17. C phase probably. So yeah, 17 volts on that right there. It's windy, guys. Sorry. So so sorry. Oh, I'm gonna set you right there for a Ah, oh, crap. Look, look at my dummy. There we go. Get my meter up here. See, I don't like doing this kind of crap. Phase loss? Seriously? We just had this. And, man. Shit. Alright, guys. Uh, let's see how I can do this. You know what? This is a lesson learned to bring my damn tripod. It really is. I'm in the knees in the dirt. Oh, I got a dropping phase somewhere. Let's see if it's coming. Let's just reset that. Let's see if we can get a. Uh, on if I can. This disconnect might be screwed up. It's starting to rain too guys. I might have to wait till Monday. This is our hallway RTU. It's not really that important. But I ain't going to be up here and lightning and rain and then messing around with 208 volts. And I'm by myself. Nobody will find me up here on this roof for days probably. If I do something stupid, so. Now you got Yeah. 
118, 118, 118. That spade's barely, like, looks like it's barely in there. But. So there's nothing the matter with this disconnect. Probably something wrong with this damn meter. Oh, hell. It's starting to rain. Guys, like I said, this is not important. I'm sorry. This is one of those videos where I'm always cut short. Well, it's not a short video by all means. All right, let's check out some, some check out some three-phase stuff on those contactors again. Oops, I already was on voltage. Um, here, I'm gonna get higher than this. Um, Sixteen volts. Oh, there's fuses back here. Oh. Jeff, you dummy, bro. There's few guys. I, I'm. I sometimes I do stuff stupid. Look, there's little tiny fuses back here. It could have got hit by lightning or something. So let's check check these fuses now. Jesus, I'm sorry, guys. I forgot about those. And so there's fuses in the disconnect, fuses here, and then it goes to a breaker that's in here. It's like freaking crazy. All right, anyway. Uh, ground. So 120 is coming in. 120 is not leaving. So I'm going to take a, a picture of that. That's a T43, um, which is totally different than all the other ones as far as serial numbers. But here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to take a picture while I'm up here. And we'll get the fuses. And then hopefully that will be the uh, the next video. Y'all get to see me replace these weird looking bus fuses here. So that's weird. I'm, I'm, okay. That, that explains our phase drop. So. And it's starting to rain. Good thing I found that. Because I need to button this thing up pretty quick. Let me take my pictures. Then I'll be getting off the. Oh, I hit phone. Instead of camera. Yeah. Alright, let's take some pictures. Alright, ready and dude, 150 amps and it blew that. Those are 150 amp fuses. And it blew them. Hot diggity dog. We're we're having face problems around this property, guys, I think. This is like the third? Because we had the A-arm, we had the carrier, and now we have this one, another carrier. But as you'll see, it's coming, bros. I gotta get this buttoned up and get out of here. I'm gonna turn off this power, because it's not gonna do any good being on anyway. Here it comes, guys. I'm gonna get wet. But y'all coming with me. Woo! Look at that. That's moist. I'm telling you, it's just coming in. <laughs> Your weather for the day. <laughs> coming in, it's just a tornado out of the middle of nowhere. So, yes, I'm Jeff the Manus, man. If I don't get blown away and, and totally saturated and stuff, at least y'all will. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. I'm going to button her up and get the hell out of this roof. We'll see you on the next one, guys.